Hi everyone, my name is Benedict Perot and I am the founder of the Limo Stroller and today I'm going to show you how to install your soft goods on the fold-away seat especially and for all of the new soft goods that have arrived in the US and in Europe. Um, we've had a few tiny little changes, um, mainly due to certification requirements. And so all of the past tutorial videos uh, didn't show with these new little clips. And so I'm gonna show it to you myself. That way, if you have any problems assembling, you can look at this video and I will walk you through it. Okay, the idea is that it's gonna be simple. So in the bag with the soft goods, you are gonna receive with your stroller, a box of soft goods like that, or sometimes it's slid directly into the box with the stroller. Um, the main seat here, okay, which slides very easily, and that I can quickly show you afterwards, that takes only a few seconds. You've got your canopy with the rods, same thing. You put the rods in, and that, boom, is very easy. So this is important because if you've got a small child, we now have three different heights, and which allows like for like even a 12 month old or a 15 month old to be like strapped in really nicely and to be more comfortable. Um, the way the factory puts it is that they put it at the top level. So I would say the bottom level is for like 12 months, 15 months old. Uh, the medium level is going to be around 18 months old. And then from the top level, it's starting at the age of two, three, four, five, six, whatever age you want, but that'll be the highest that you have. I'm going to show you today how to put it at the medium level and that way either top or bottom medium is going to be easy for everyone. So the way you get it here from the factory with the straps like this, you got to make sure that here the um, stitching stays on this side because that's going to be important in order to keep the buckle. So what I'm going to do is I'm just simply going to pull it out completely. Okay. It comes out, pull it out. I'm going to keep it in my hand to go through the medium slot here, the middle slot, and then put my hand through to pull the strap all the way out. And here it's gonna block here with the buckle, and here I pull it out and like my thumb touches the stitching part, so I know it's on the right side. Same thing for here, I'm just gonna simply pull it out completely all the way, and then put it into the middle slot here. Stick my finger in, pull it all the way and I can still feel here the stitching on my thumb so that's all good. So this is how I'm gonna put it through now into the seat. Now what's really important is um, that you have in the bag these little plastic buckles. Normally you have five of them because you need five to do four for the back breast and one for the seat. Okay here we have Backrest, I'm holding here. I've got the stitching on my thumb. I'm gonna pass it through the back here, hold it, and then I'm gonna put this little buckle around the slot here to secure the fabric. So I slide it in, make sure it goes in through all the holes, up, and then here, I hope you can see well, it's nice and flat, and it's blocked. I will take buckle number two and do the same thing with the other side. I make sure that the strap is flat and straight. I make sure that I've got the stitching on my thumb, pass it through and there you go. And here it's secure. It won't go through. Then next step. So I've got this, make sure everything's flat. I'm going to pull a little bit and now I'm going to pull the backrest soft goods down, but not all the way because I want to be able to see these two middle waist slots here so that I can access them easily to put the other buckles. So I'm going to pull down pretty much just like three quarters of the way just so that your hands, fingers can see these slots because that's going to be important. And I'm going to pull these straps completely. And now what I'm going to do is there's going to, you're going to see on both sides, there's one where there's just normal stitching and there's one where there's a little hoop. This is for the buckle. So I'm going to take this hoop and I'm going to pass the hoop, not on the inside, but on the outside like this. Okay. And to go into the, the waist slot here and then down into the waist slot on the seat, which I'm going to go get from behind. Okay. To pass 
my little buckle. So here you go and pull and make sure it's nice and flat. So that's number one, that's done. You take number two, same thing. You're gonna put it around from the outside, slide it into the fabric with the slot, waist slot, and then you pull it and you go through the same waist slot here and the seat. You take your little buckle, and there you go, and then you pull back out, make sure that it goes through, and that it's nice and flat. And there you go, you're secured at the top, the shoulders, and at the waist. Last step is simply to slide the soft goods down to the bottom, but do not over push it, okay? It, it shouldn't crumple, it should stay nice and straight. There is a reason why there is extra fabric on top like this, is for the comfort of the child, um, for the height as well, and for the comfort it behind. And this part should be very nicely straight, just like that. So make sure everything's good. And the last step is you're gonna grab the flap that's behind and you're gonna slide it underneath and around the tube. It's gotta hide the tube that's right here. It's gonna hide it, it's gonna go around, and that you've got that Velcro here. And you're just gonna Velcro it in. The last step is the seat. Slide it in and the buckle has to be this way, okay? It's got to be put in this way. So I'm gonna slide in here, okay? It's got to be like the rounded part towards the outside. Here I'm gonna put it through and here I've got slots. On your stroller, because this is one of my strollers I had from before, I have only one slot. Maybe you have two slots. If you have two slots, you choose which slot you want according to the size of your child. If you've got a very small child, then you might want to put it on the inside slot uh, so that it's tighter. But if you want something looser and that's going to give more space, then put it on the outside slot. So you're going to slide it in like this. Okay, just the, just the strap to go inside here. And then we're going to take the last buckle. Remember, you have five of these. This is the last one. And same thing, you're gonna slide it through to secure. And then you pull, you make sure that, okay, it's strapped and the buckle is in the right direction. If it's in the wrong, you just flip it over. And then the last part is to pass the soft goods over. So you're gonna pass this around here, the plastic part. You're gonna Velcro the sides, okay? Make sure you put them nice to the top, to the backs. Okay, and then the last part is this little flappy part of the fabric has to go around so that you can Velcro it here so that it holds. So go around and here you're gonna put it through and you're gonna Velcro. Close it off like that, put it tight. And then what's really important is that always in, for the reason that we need to slide this underneath, what you can feel here on the seat is that there's kind of like less padding here just on this part here. And the reason why there's less padding is so that the buckle can really sit here when you close the seat. So look, I'm gonna close the buckle. When your child gets off the seat, I really suggest and recommend that you lock the buckle just so that the straps don't get stuck when you slide it in. Try to stick everything here inside, okay? And that way when you fold it, there's nothing hanging around that can get stuck in the sliding part. So. Either you leave the sticker if you want to leave it, you can get rid of it. Just make sure that the buckles are underneath the fabric and not through the fabric, okay? Just so that it won't get stuck when you slide it in. So, you know what? I'm going to leave the, the sticker on. If it comes off, it's not a big deal. It was just a little warning. So now you can see that you can just slide it in really easily. And last step is I'm going to show you how to quickly... Slide on the main seat soft goods. So you undid the two clips here. Here, the straps are already put. Just slide it around the tube. And you've got these straps with Velcro that you pass through the seat, okay? But that really, when you go underneath, make sure that you, you attach them really as flat as you can, always for that problem that you don't want things hanging around if they hang around then everything gets kind of stuck and doesn't slide very well so you just do that you pass here the little clips and 
on each side to secure the seat around. And there you go. That's for the main seat. So that's very, very easy. Um, if you want to close this off and get rid of it because your child is too big, you just simply roll it and tuck it underneath here. Okay. And then here, as you can see, I slide it in and I slide it in. Thanks a lot. And I hope you enjoy your limo. <laughs>